Hello, my name is Steve Mulberry with GIS Inc. And in today's video snippet, I'm going to be joined by my colleague Emerson Chu, who is a solution engineer within our water team. So first off, uh, Emerson, thank you so much for joining me today. Absolutely, thanks Steve for having me. So last time we spoke, you walked us through the process of performing an isolation trace within the ArcGIS utility network. And today we want to explore another important capability found in this technology, which is the concept of containment association. So Emerson, can you explain to us why containments play a critical role in the utility network specifically for the water distribution center? Sure, Steve. Well, simply put, this capability gives users of the water system the ability to enable the modeling of assemblies and complex devices in your network while also controlling map clutter. In other words, containments allow for a dense collection of features to be represented by a single feature on the map, either with polygons, linear or point representations. And it really gets interesting here because the utility network allows for nested containers as well as a one-to-many relationship between content and containers. Why don't I show you another example? So one of the biggest benefits of the UN is the use of containers and associations. Unfortunately, this can be one of the bigger hurdles to implement due to perceived notions of complexity and level of maintenance. I wanted to point out two things with this demo. First, using the enhanced pro group feature templates, containers are very easy to add to the network. I have a template with a meter pit and four meters. I simply select my template and drop a tap along with the service line. After the edits are complete, I then have a complete completed meter pit with meters contained within, along with logical associations between each component. Second, this reduces the need to manage multiple pieces of geometry that would traditionally be a burden to digitize and maintain. Okay, thanks Emerson for that demo. So I guess to summarize, the ArcGIS Utility Network has been completely re-engineered from what we are familiar with inside the geometric network to handle these advanced assemblies and complex devices that could be found in any network, especially a water distribution network. Uh, you got it exactly correct, Steve. The utility network is all about the higher fidelity dat data model and containers and associations are a great representation of that. Excellent. Thank you, Emerson. I really appreciate you taking the uh, time to talk with us and walk us through one of the many capabilities found uh, in the new ArcGIS Utility Network and giving us that overview of containment associations. Uh, and to those watching this recording, thank you so much for joining. And look uh, for more of these short video snippets on the ArcGIS Utility Network as we get closer to our webinar where we will go much deeper into this technology. Thank you. Thank you.